Hey guys, you're here for a study on the Sol Invictus aspect, which is what gives you sunspots. I think Bungie screwed up, or it took a shortcut to balance it, because this aspect takes 4 seconds off of your super duration and takes more super energy on each hammer throw. This is while not in a sunspot. If you pop your super on the ground, you get a free sunspot. Having that sunspot increases your super duration by 2 seconds, which is still 2 seconds worse than not having the aspect at all. What about total throws? With the sunspot buff, you can throw 10 hammers, only 6 without sunspots or the aspect on. What about duration with throws? With 2 throws and the initial buff, it was actually 1 second worse than not having the aspect at all. Throwing twice while touching 2 sunspots made it better. So it's really important to pop your super on the ground and stand in the sunspot from your throws. Otherwise, your super is worse than not having the Soul Invictus aspect at all. Having one throw with the buff active and two throws without, it was just the same as three throws without the Soul Invictus aspect, lasting a total of 15 seconds. Note that Phoenix Cradle Boots doubles your buff timer, easily making the super better in PvP if you pop your super on the ground. As far as damage goes, Soul Invictus did more than 50% extra damage to bosses, making it the clear winner in PvE, but maybe not in PvP. Special thanks to Mr. Roomba and Data Compendium for this. Cheese forever, Guardian.